in all of them. It was in the heart of Lake of the Woods where Minister Carolyn Bennett announced Canada is investing more than 17 million in water and housing projects in Treaty 3 territory. It's done in collaboration um, with the, the treaty and the leadership and, and, uh, and it is uh, um, again uh, a beginning because we know the needs are still much greater than what we're announcing today. 1.2 million is going toward water improvements for eight different communities, including one that will end a boil water advisory for Wajiskodagam. The community has been on an advisory for a year due to a lack of funding to maintain their water plant. We're kind of behind times and this is kind of going to help us kind of catch up to the, I guess, what normal Canadians experience in their everyday life when they go to the tap. Part of the funding is also going to Show Lake 40, which has been under a boil water advisory for two decades. Money will go toward a new water treatment plant for the community. Uh, On hand for the announcements were Wojciechodegam Chief Chris Skeed and Treaty 3 Grand Chief Francis Cavanaugh. I'm very optimistic that moving forward they're going to be fixing and addressing these, uh, these situations with water. Also announced today, $16 million to be split among 17 First Nations in Treaty 3 to help with costs of building new homes and renovating existing ones. It's, it's a step in the right direction. We're still not there yet, of course, but you know this is definitely a benefit to my community members because you know within the community there is some uh, overcrowding in houses, which is a safety concern, of course. So at least with these announcements, it'll alleviate some of the pressures that uh, we face as, uh, as, as a community. Brittany Hobson, ABT National News, near Kenora.